Okay, here's how to make a gist the videos directory. Let's make a test gist file. Let's open Sublime. Let's put in hello. This is test gist. Save it, close it. Now um, there's a file. Let's more this file. And there you can see the text. Okay. Now let's go here. So here's GitHub. Here's a profile. This is my profile. Typically, you would click here to make a gist, but we're gonna do it from the command line. So I'll show you how to do that. Jim install. Let's just do Jim gist. I'll pull it up. Yeah, there it's top one. All right. So you want to um, go down here. You can install two ways. This way or with brew. I use brew. I think it's the best. Mine's already installed. I'll just show you that's all you do. And then you can go through the documentation of it, different features they have. I'll show you what I do. And this is what I do for 99% of all gists I make. So you do gist, so you call the program, dash p. These are called flags, so it means private. I want a secret gist. I want to open it automatically, and I want to copy it to my clipboard so I can paste it in an email or whoever I want to send it to. And now the name of the file, in this case, testgist.txt. Hit enter, should open up. We should see our, as we do here, our secret, which means no one can find this. Here's the text. And to show it's already been pasted in a clipboard, I won't copy anything. I'll just hit Command V to paste it. And there's my gist. So I have on my clipboard, secret, it opened for me. And that's pretty much all there is to making a gist.